Every day is different. Every video is different. But my passion will always be the same. This is Kai from Warshawn, aka Stormboy13, and the storm has arrived. Wow! Hi guys, Stormboy13. I've got to have to be a quick video, I'm afraid. My camera's on low battery, could be to do with the cold weather, but either that, one job. Charge the camera up. Anyways, I'll make this quick. Time for the web forecast for the week ahead. And uh, I haven't been, to be honest, I haven't been that far off last week. Kind of got most of the days spot on, especially Friday. Saw a bit of sleet in places, but it, because it wasn't extreme enough, I didn't really film any of it because it'd probably be a waste of time. Whilst in other places, had a bit of a covering. Uh, but trust me, what I'm saying is, did not have a covering where I was. It was too wet and it wasn't quite freezing enough. I think it could be because it's lower. Well, I am, so it's just the way it goes. But anyways, um, it's time for this week's weather. There is a small risk of some sleet again, but I think mostly it'll be to do with rain. The weather's not looking very pleasant. Maybe tomorrow might be your best day. The weather this week is going to be mostly cold, temperatures around or a little bit below average for the time of the year. There will be spells of rain at times. I think the odd day may be a bit drier than others, but overall, it's a disappointingly wet week. Well, I shouldn't say disappointing, it is December after all. But it is going to be a chilly week, so get wrapping up. It's not going to get any milder anytime soon. But it won't be too windy. Next week, might not be so lucky. More detail on that in a few minutes. Today's weather, a lot of clouds, not as dull as last week's Sunday, so I seem to remember. There's a little bit of blue around, but overall, plenty of cloud. I think it's probably less thick, but, uh, and there will be some showery bursts of patchy rain at some point during the day. So, it's thankfully dry where I'm doing it right now. The temperatures, though, really struggling. Three degrees Celsius at the very best. It does feel like that, to be fair. The rainfall chance will be 60% today, even though it's dry right now where I am. There could be some spells of rain later on some points in the afternoon. But overall, not a great day. Tonight's weather doesn't actually take that much for the temperatures to drop below freezing or around. Um, I think there will be clear spells as well. The winds aren't strong either. So again, even with quite a lot of cloud, temperatures only doesn't take that much to drop for around freezing levels. So frosty and possibly icy night, I'm afraid, to start your new working week with loads of freezing. Now, Monday will probably be the best day of the week, but... Uh, even that not completely dry. I think there will be sunny spells tomorrow, but uh, maybe just the odd light shower risk, a 20% chance of rain. But I must stress that if we don't see the fog burn away, because uh, we may see some fog tomorrow morning, if that doesn't burn throughout the day, temperatures could actually struggle with freezing. If that clears away, we may get some sunny spells, even that temperature is only about three or four degrees at best for Monday tomorrow. So a cold day regardless. Um, and like I said, rainfall chance is low, just the odd light shower would around 20%. But by the time we get into, well, Monday night actually into early Tuesday, it could be very, very wet. We've got vigorous very low pressure, but quite windy, but nothing too stormy. But quite a lot of rain could fall down in a short space of time. So a very wet spell to start Tuesday, it should clear away. I think it's likely Tuesday morning will start off very wet. Even when that clears, mainly dull and damp into the afternoon. Temperatures again, another chilly day, 5 degrees Celsius. And I, I can't rule out a little bit of sleet and wet snow again. But mostly overall, it's Atlantic system, so it's more likely to be rain. So 5 degrees Celsius, the rainfall chance pretty high, it's around 70%. Just check and see if we're still recording. I think Wednesday isn't too bad, but even that, there will be some showers around in places. I think there will be... Sunny spells around, uh, could be very wet on the ground, so the temperatures again, another pretty chilly day, it's just around 5 or 6 degrees Celsius, there will be showers in places, there will be some drier spells, uh, so like I said, 5 degrees Celsius, that's your high, and the rainfall chance for around 60%, so once again, you might want to get your umbrellas out. Into Thursday, I think quite similar, maybe a bit more cloud around. I think we should escape the weather systems in a way, but we'll still see some showers around. So, won't be raining all day on Thursday, but remaining dull. Temperatures again, a little bit below average, 5-6 degrees Celsius on Thursday. Rainfall chance again is around 60%. 
Uh, nothing too windy though. In fact, the winds actually for a time could be quite light. As we're in the center, there's no winds to circle around, so the airs will be quite still. And that's why it's not moving things around very much. Into Friday, a lot of uncertainty as always, but there's a possibility we could see another area, some very wet weather, some heavy rain at times, possibly a little bit more windy. The temperatures are still similar to what they will be all week. Six degrees Celsius Friday, further rain or showers at times, might turn a bit breezy, but there's a lot of uncertainty though, so every, anything could change. Six degrees Friday, 60%, maybe 70% chance of rain. Into next Saturday, maybe for a time, briefly, the weather may settle down. So we may see a ridge of high pressure. Uh, temperatures are not changing much. We're still on the cold side of the jet stream, but there will be some sunny spells. Temperatures six degrees Celsius, rainfall chance low, it's around 20%. The winds will be quite light, but it doesn't last long though. Into next week, the weather will stay very wet and windy, well, much windy into next week. The temperatures usually when it's windy are not normally that cold. So I think there's a chance temperatures may pick up a little bit. I can't guarantee double-figure temperatures for most places, but temperatures will be a little high next week, about where it should be, but we will be seeing some very wet and possibly stormy weather. Low risk at this stage, but it's a possibility it could turn quite wild into next week. So, not, not great into next week, and again, quite a lot of clouds, so not a huge amount of sunshine either, so... Pretty much of a messy picture for the next couple of weeks, I'm afraid. So that's a quick recap into next week, but for this week, not as windy, bit more colder but overall further rain at times and uh, obviously not much sunshine. That's this week's weather guys and um, I'll try and get some out for you if I possibly can. Uh, this is the last week for me where I've got a lot of studying to do so possibly by the next week I may have a little bit more free time so just bear with me for this week. You saw my previous video, two, uh, one of my web videos, not quite two but even that, uh, one of my web videos got shown on B uh, Channel 4's Britain's Wildest Weather 2020 and I may give you another update in a couple of days if so anything happens. But other than that guys, stay safe, like, comment and subscribe and um, Storm is now out.